Hi guys, what's going on? Welcome back, or if you're new here, welcome to my channel. I have actually been away for quite a little time. I just came back from Cabo and it was the nicest trip ever. There's this new hotel that opened up there. It was like a, it's called the Vissery. Oh my gosh, this hotel is unbelievable. It's almost like futuristic. I filmed some footage, so I'll be sure to upload it in the next couple days but i'm back and we're better than ever <laughs> i'm actually putting together kind of like a filming slash beauty room because i really really miss recording and filming hauls and such so this new setup is gonna be elite <laughs> it's not finished completely yet but i just wanted to show you guys the progress so far and also just wanted to see if you guys like have any recommendations on decor what you guys would do differently because I still have a few more things to get decor wise but I want to keep the room very minimal because I have an issue with hoarding a lot of things so we're trying to make that change <laughs> I feel like the more simple your things are the more you know where everything is and the more you feel organized in general but on the other side of that there's also like the fact that I like to have many things like for example lipsticks there's so many different shades that you can have so <laughs> and clothes and shoes so i don't know the girly things you know <laughs> but i'll show you guys the room so far i am super super excited oh my gosh when i show you guys my vanity table there's legit a long long story behind it but i finally have it and i'm so so happy so i'll take you guys there before we actually head into the room i wanted to show you guys one more thing because this touch is like it's so me and if you guys look right above the door i have a little evil eye there because we gotta keep them bad vibes away okay you guys only only good stuff here so we're walking into the room it's not complete you can almost hear my echo too because it's so empty at the moment but i just placed this mirror here this mirror i got it from ikea it's the best mirror i've ever found it's like the largest and i like the chrome detail on the side so it's just oh that needs to be wiped <laughs> But that is what it looks like. I really, really love this mirror because it's really good just to kind of see your overall, overall outfit. Um, I don't know if I want to keep it in the corner or if I want to kind of place it along like a flat wall. But I feel like keeping it in the corner kind of opens up the whole room in general. And I have this dresser as well just because I have a bunch of like, I keep my pajamas and everything in here. But I feel like I'm going to move this into the closet here. So just a quick overview so we have the mirror this dresser which is not supposed to be there but i'm just keeping it there because there's going to be some work done to the closet in here and this closet i tell you it's it's a mess like complete mess <laughs> oh my gosh i have to organize it but i'm gonna try to fit the dresser like right under there and let me show you guys my absolute favorite favorite part which is this mirror! Look at it! Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Look at the chrome detail on this desk. Like, oh my gosh, look at that. Yes! Oh, I love it. Then it has the mirror accent all over. And then there's a little drawer in here as well. This is like a, from the sticker from unboxing it. So this mirror, I actually have to sit down and tell you guys the story because it's so long. So the story behind this desk is super super long but while i tell you guys the story we need to get that good lighting here so ha ha let's check this out oh yes yes oh, i love this mirror i'll tell you guys all the details for the mirror as well but we'll start with the desk here so this desk i actually found it on wayfair and when i found it i immediately immediately fell in love with it but i have an issue with browsing all my selection and all the options that are available before actually going ahead and placing the order but i sometimes take too long so what happened with this desk is i placed it into my cart and then a few days later when i was like you know what i feel like i've seen all the all the selection that they have and, and this is the desk that i want by the time i decided to actually go ahead and place the order it was sold out so that was that was a sad moment for me. And I waited about a week, maybe like a week and a half, but it still was not back in stock. So I'm like, you know what? This is the desk for me. 
and I need this desk in my life, so I went on a hunt. <laughs> One thing with me is when I want something, I will try to make a way around so I can eventually get it. So best believe I made it happen. So what happened with the desk is um, I kind of described the, like I went into Google and then I put like mirrored, chrome, desk, and then a bunch of different options showed up, different brand, but it's the same exact style, same exact dimensions and everything. So I found the same model desk, but from a different brand. So what, what I did then is um, there was a store nearby that seemed to carry the brand. So I literally called the store. I'm like, hey, do you guys have it? She's like, we don't have it in store, but we can order for you. And I was like, yes. And the funny thing is, on Wayfair, the desk was like 1200 bucks and it was on sale for like 530 um, which is a good deal. And then when I actually picked it up in store, it was actually like not even 500 So it was a win and I'm happy. <laughs> I'm super duper happy. Look at, look at my desk. And then this mirror, um, I actually got this mirror off Amazon. I was super, super picky because I wanted it to be very large and I don't want it to be like just a random mirror in the middle because I usually just use like this tiny mirror here to do my makeup up close because it gives you like all the details and everything. Uh, she needs to be wiped down too. <laughs> but I'm like, you know what? This vibe right here, I'm, I'm here for it and I'm loving it. So I picked it up from Amazon. It was about 250, which is a really, really good deal for a mirror this size, especially with the LED lights all around. And then the features that it has, oh my gosh, I love it. So I'll show you guys. So you have a on and off button right here, off and then on. And then the M button, it's like, I guess it's like mode. You can make it cool tone, warm, and then I guess this is neutral. So cool tone, warm, neutral. And this is what it looks like with the different settings. So this one is neutral, this one is cool, and this one is warm. <clears throat> I like to keep it on the neutral tone. And then with this other button down here, if you press it and hold your finger on it, it makes it appear brighter. It's like becoming much brighter. And then if you press it again, it'll dim it down. Oh my gosh, isn't that so cool? I'm, ugh, technology's come such a long way. <laughs> yes beautiful i really really i'm in love with this mirror honestly a good deal and it's exactly how you want it like this whole thing in general didn't even cost me a thousand bucks so i love it and then these flowers right here i picked them up from winners uh literally just picked them up yesterday i still have to remove the tag as you guys can tell but i was just too excited to show you guys the little details that i have <laughs> and then this mirror i've had for about like damn it's been a really long time i've had this for six years yeah costco is where it is at picked this up at costco for like 30 bucks six years ago and it's literally still going strong like it has this side and then and then this side here it like whew, we are zoomed in where are we but yeah so this side is like very zoomed in am i upside down anyways i have to move this from here this has been my favorite piece ever this is a uh, bose bluetooth speaker she is strong <laughs> i love it and then i have these i think i'm going to change the pink to maybe white or just a different kind of color I'm not really feeling the pink anymore and this vase i stole from my sister and i spray painted it <laughs> this vase was actually black before but i just spray painted it white i got my brother to do it for me and then over here this is also i believe it's called the alex drawer from ikea very very good for storage i also i saw a video of a girl on youtube she kind of like cut up some foam pieces to organize her items in the drawers which i think is very very smart because everything in here is super super messy at the moment like oh my gosh i just picked this one up picked up the olaplex number nine ha really haven't tried it yet though this has been my favorite this is like my third bottle very very good for softening the hair and this I just picked up not too long ago as well because I have a lot of flyaways at the top of my head and then this is like, <laughs> their marketing is so cute. I hair stick for cool people. <laughs> Here, I'll kind of untwist the cap so you guys can see. 
and it looks just like that and it's a little bit tacky but once you put it on in, on your hair it's not gonna look very greasy it just kind of tames everything down this is very good i like the packaging on it too very cute okay so organizing is not so good here oh my god this lotion tree hut i want to marry the brand tree hut like every single item they have is so amazing this is like the best body butter or like moisturizer or lotion that i've ever used in my whole entire life like this stuff soaks into your skin okay we'll put that back i'm getting carried away <laughs> and then in this drawer right here i have my nail drill to just remove any shellac or anything um, I have some files, I have like a few press-on nail packages here because it's so convenient. Like I, I enjoy getting my nails done, but I just don't enjoy the process of them growing out and then having to take them off and can be damaging to your nails. So I like doing press-ons sometimes because you can always change them up in like a week and, and no damage and it's just, it's very convenient. So I have a few here and then I also have like some uh, shellac colors. Like in just regular ones. And I have some tanning lotion. And then up here, I still don't know what I'm gonna... There's like a few extra things that I have to organize. But this is like a UV light. It's by the brand Apex. It's really, really good. And then... Ugh, this is this is a mess. <laughs> Complete mess. That needs to be organized. I have like a few other things in here. I don't even know what's in here. A bunch of lip products. Oh my god, I just picked up a bunch of stuff from ColourPop. They are amazing. But anyways, that needs to be organized. This is like my extra notepad stuff and just a bunch of extra random things in there. One more thing I'm thinking to add is I have this poster. It's from Scarface. It says the world is yours, but I'm just debating on where to put it. I'll actually show you guys what it looks like. So this is the poster that I will be placing on the wall, but I just don't know where yet. The reason I chose this, I actually found this print online and then I printed it myself from like a local print shop. I am in love with this quote because sometimes like you get so caught up in just thinking and stressing and limiting yourself. But if you really think about it, like the world truly is yours. It has always been yours. It will always be yours. <laughs> So this, I'm in love. I'm actually thinking about tattooing this on myself, but I just don't know where. But this poster, I will place in my room there, but um, I'll show you guys where I'm thinking. Thinking of either putting it, uh, I'm, I don't not there. Mm, possibly here is my number one spot, or I would say here, but I feel like I don't wanna, I feel like it's gonna interfere with like the vanity unless it complements the vanity. I don't know. But I feel like I want to put it here because right when you walk into the room, or like right when you walk into the room, this is the first wall that you see. So I feel like it adds a little bit of a flare. But let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think this wall or right above the vanity? Um. So that's all for the room so far. I still have a lot more things to put together but i don't want to keep it minimal but i'm super excited now that i have this vanity room you guys know what that means that means more and more and more videos to come <laughs> like this mirror for some halls you got them angles and the mirror back there could like i feel like i could arrange it in a way where you could see like the front of the outfit and also the back but i really really love it let me know what you guys would do differently with the whole setup what you guys think but I just wanted to share that all because I am so excited. Like every single day I would check the tracking for these things and just like search on Pinterest for different vision boards of what I want it to look like, what I want to do with it. I'm happy to be sharing this with you guys. <laughs> just my little moment of pure bliss. Um, but thanks for tuning in and I will definitely be sure to film much more videos in this new space. It brings me so much happiness just to be in this space. So. I really do enjoy filming. So be sure to like and subscribe so you guys can see any future videos that I have coming. This mirror needs to be wiped. Oh, that's bothering me. But that's all for today. Bye, guys.